Who else do you have? Big three points this afternoon. Massive three points. Um, I think I would say that's the best result of the season. I would say certainly the best result since me and Adam came in. Uh, just because of players we had unavailable, the players that played had to, had to play, some had to play in slightly strange positions and we were asking them to do things that's not natural to them. Uh, so to, to come away with three points against a good team as well, by the way, I, I really like the way that, that, that Weymouth play. But to come away with a win, uh, the, the players deserve a massive, massive amount of credit. And say a makeshift team and also another clean sheet as well. Defensively, we looked pretty organised out there. Yeah, did well, did well. There's a couple of little scares first half, but uh, overall we uh, we contained them pretty pretty well. Obviously, we we were under pressure the last ten, which I suppose you can expect. Uh, we look a little bit nervous, maybe. But uh, as I say, the lads have put a great shift into there. I don't think that can be underestimated. Uh, as we touched on earlier, tremendous credit goes out to to all of them, especially the subs as well. The gaffer was quick to mention the subs and, and quick to mention that. We kept telling the lads that wasn't in the team that they would be needed at some stage, you know, with the games coming thick and fast, suspensions, injuries. That's proved to be the case, and those players that stepped in today, you know, uh, uh, have, uh, have done themselves proud. Mm. And after coming in Monday, Finn Ballard McBride sort of caught the eye again once again this afternoon. Yeah, he's, a, he's an intelligent footballer, Finn. Uh, he quickly picks the style of the game up or the way that the game's going and uh, he kind of got stronger as the game went on today and he was instrumental in, in, in a lot of our good our good play but it, w it would be wrong to single out you know just one player I mean Billy came in uh, Billy Viger came in today for the first time in a while uh, and was f fantastic for what 70 75 minutes till he ran out of steam but we could go through we could go through everybody and, and, and praise them so it's a good day at the office you know we've still got is it three big games to go massive games to go uh, and, and we've got to you know look after ourselves and we've not got to rely on um, anybody else and I've just had a quick look at the table there and it's it's decent reading. Uh, we've gained points on pretty much everyone, maybe just Dartford down there have got the win. A couple of teams have drew, some have lost, we got a point behind, is it Torquay now? So, you know, hopefully we, we continue to look upwards, but by no means is, is, is the job done yet. And sort of as a defensive effort in the last few weeks as well, obviously that's now our fourth clean sheet in seven games. So what's changed or what's clicked? I don't think it is. I think it's 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 uh, more time with the gaffer, more time with his philosophy, the way that he wants to play, uh, the way that he wants to defend and lock teams in. Um, and again, you know, the players' uh, performance levels, I think, have, have picked up in recent weeks and in, in recent matches. So, you know, all in all, we're in a pretty good place at the moment. But experience tells me that there's always a right hook waiting for you around the corner and it's just how you deal with the right hook will determine you know the outcome of the season now so there is one coming it will come it's just whether we can ride it or keep it at bay or what and then and then we march forward and say so we look forward now onto wednesday and a trip to truro yeah another long trip to uh, gloucester again um we know what we're going to get off of truro they play a certain way maybe them they're not the most attractive team but they're good at what they do and they deserve credit for that so you know they've picked up some results so uh, they picked up a few draws uh, they're not out of it yet even though they've got those games in hand so it's another massive game and you know if we can go there get the three points it goes a long way to ensuring our survival thank you Steve. thank you